Okay. I'm not totally worried. Not even with these uh, shoulda, woulda, coulda songs. No, I'm just going to let you down. No <laughs> more. <laughs> so we are live here on Facebook. On If you have not tuned in, tuned in, tune in to www.raisethepraise100.com or you can call us at 346-355-0100. I want to tell you right now, we got some great things going on. We got some great things in store. Um, but we're gonna go ahead and get into our what is it called? You gonna show up or you gonna show up? You gonna show up and show out today? She need to get it together, y'all. Y'all know how we do it. We are showing up and showing out for our community. What you got going on in the city? Let your girl know. You can always call me at 346-355-0100 or you know, hit your girl up. Erica B, you know, let me know what you got going on. We want to come out. We want to represent. We want to be a part. But right now, we got open mic night coming. Now, all those that think they got the funny, they can be funny. They, you know, they laugh and chit chat with their friends and they think they got it going on. You got jokes, Robert. You got some jokes. Hey, <laughs> if you got the jokes and they clean comedy, we want to see you at open mic night. <laughs> February the 24th. Come on out at the Match Theater, 3400 Main Street. I want you to contact Gospel Comedy. Contact Gospel Comedy on Facebook, Instagram. Look, registration is free, y'all. We it just is. want you to come out and have fun. It is. F R. It's free. And, and you know what? You know what? That might be a great opportunity. You never know what doors will be open for you. So look, come on out with the funny. Let us know if you think you got it from the professionals to the first timers. We no judgment zone. No yeah, judgment no, zone. We just want to have fun. Open mic night. Oh, oh no! The way Big Skinny <laughs> living, that may be a little judgment. Go on. <laughs> That ship we had to stay at. I was trying to bring it back to the port. We just have coming up safe and silly company crew. Yeah. Have you seen the look yet? Are you ready? Did you drop that little change? Look, it's seventy five dollars. Drop your seventy five. We are going shipping out. Speaking of both sale in October thirty first to November the fourth. We will be headed out to Costa Mail from Gavis. Now, y'all know, if you've ever been to a Save and Silly Comedy show or a Gospel Comedy show, you know it's going to be the fun. We're going to have some great comedians on there. We're going to have some great things going on. You want to be on the boat. And you know we got a commercial. on the boat. You know we got a commercial. Those want to hear that. I mean, we're willing to share the commercial. What's up? What's up? It's your boy, Cousin Al. Listen, man, the Save and Silly Cruise is going down October 31st. We are leaving out of Gavis and that big G. And we're going to Azumel, hey, como esta? Hey, me estoy moliendo como un perro abandonado. We going out there, man. I don't even know what I just said, but all I know is I'm learning my Spanish little by little. Uh, bu buenos dios, uh, buenas tardes, and um, uh, que pasó, uh, bien, no, bien, bien. We finna be in Cozumel. That's what I want y'all to know. So go ahead, book your cabin with LD Entertainment so you can get into all the exclusive events. I just added an event, y'all. I just added an event. I just added an event, and they might they might get mad at me. They might, like, you know, I might get fined for this, but, hey, you know, I'm going to just take the charge. But I'm challenging every comedian on the boat, every comedian to a versus. I'm challenging y'all to a versus. Like, what's up? Like, And I ain't talking about no jokes. I'm talking about a wet T-shirt contest. Because, I mean, you think you could beat me at a wet T-shirt contest? Yeah, to the no, to the no, 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 no. So yeah, I, I'm. I might as well just keep on eating so I can win. Cause I mean, I just don't see. I ain't no use of me stop eating now. Cause on the boat, I'm finna be eating burgers and and fries and and chicken and squirrel and all kind of stuff they go have on there. But anyway, go ahead and book your cabin while it's cheap. LD Entertainment. The number is somewhere around here. And um, uh, why do I keep pointing like it's actually right here? It should be right here in front down down here. I don't know. I don't know. Book it. Five zero three eight six. Now you know that is just one of the shows. Whose number is that? 
Is the number. Okay. What's up, what's up? It's your boy, Cousin Al. Listen, man, the Saved and Silly Cruise is going down October 31st. We are leaving out of Galveston, that big G. And we're going to Cazumel. Hey, como esta? Hey, me estoy como un perro abandonado. We're going to... Yeah, remind me to get that song every time. Everybody, what's coming? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what? Let me just be real. If you call that other number, you're going to end up with TKK Dispatching. They have a dispatching class that's coming March the 16th from 10 to 4. The class is only $200. It is after pay. Learn how to be a broker. Learn how to book your loads. Book your loads. Um, find drivers. Scale up your loads. That's what that number was for. I am so sorry. TKK is having a dispatching class. That is one of the things we got going on in our community, showing up and showing out. They're offering these services. They're also giving y'all free lunch. Now, look, they're giving you a trade, giving you some information on it. You know, you can do this at home for a job. It's a good trade to have. You can do it personally. Say your husband, friend, family member drives you. Step in there. Cut that middleman out. Cut that broker out and go and book those lows and start making that money yourself. Again, that class is from March the 16th from four, um, 10 to 4 p.m., $200. They do have afterpay and they um, also are providing lunch. So give them a call 832 665 0386. That's what that number is really for. One more thing we got the big easy retreat. My girl Marticia is going to be there and she will be in the building dropping that knowledge. Y'all want to get in on this. Go to the big easy retreat.com. They are going to be empowering and transformation. The power of transformation is going to be on. Um, I believe it's July the 6th. You want to get in there now. Yeah. Um, you know what? It's going to be the same time as um, um, it's Essence. Essence. Essence Weekend. So, so it's no Essence contact. Weekend. It's no, you know, it's not joined together. Mm -hmm. You're going to be there for the retreat. But what other retreat can you get a little Essence in there with it? So please check them out and go listen to my girl. You know, she's going to be dropping those nuggets, um, motivating and helping you transform. Again, that's July the 6th. From 11, 5 p.m., go to the BigEasyRetreat.com. Marticia's going to be in the building. We want to support her, definitely. Um, tonight, what you doing tonight, folks? Y'all feel like a little poetry? Soul Poetry is going to have um, an event. It is at Chi-Town Wings at 5060 FM 1960. I said Wings. Oh, now, look, y'all know the joke about Erica being a wing, <laughs> so y'all gonna know I'm gonna talk about this. It's chicken, right? Involved, but it's for poetry. It is for love of the poetry, okay? For love of poetry, hosted by Soul Poetry tonight at Chi Town Wings 5060 FM 1960. If you ain't doing nothing, go on out there. They have so many great ports that'll be on the stage tonight, and y'all do give them some big snaps, give them some big snaps. Big snap, yes. And y'all know we already have um, a special guest in the building, Mr. Robert. His play is tonight and tomorrow night, Black Boys Cry. This is going to be an awesome play. It's been touring for almost a year now. You can catch it tonight at the Deluxe Theater, uh, 3305 Lowndes Avenue, 7.30 p.m. is the show. If you want to get tickets, go to www.1989dreams.com backslash Black Boys Cry. Okay. It's going down. It's a great play. It's about black men. Y'all heard them talking about it. If you stay with us, make sure you hear it. Also, February the 25th, Mama's Breath. That is a good one, y'all. I've seen that one, too. Mama's it breath. Has come, Mama's Breath. Your it mama has come back. On you? Mm. This is a history. You know, look, first of all, this is black <laughs> women. <women's laughs> so these particular <laughs> plays, now you don't know these particular um, play about black history in a way. It, it has some great black actors, but the theme of the place, Mama's Breath, uh, I guess you can't say Mama's Breath is on the mama. Yeah, we don't give away too many details. Yeah, we don't give away too many details. But um, it's also going to be on February 25th, 4 p.m. at 803 East, 36 Houston, Texas. Um, how can they get tickets to that? Do you know, uh, that one is free. So, wow. Yeah, that one is uh, free. Uh, you know, the same thing. All you gotta do is show up. So, okay. uh, it's first come, first serve. Um, and it Hosted is by the African American History mm -hmm. Program. And uh, mm -hmm. it is it is Black History. Uh, yeah. It is around the 1920s, around that era. Uh, the sharecropping was really big. Yeah. And so that's what that's what the story is about. Um, it's really about a story about a, a sharecropper um, and his brother. And uh, I'm not gonna go into too many details. Their family. Spoiling mm -hmm. the, their family. 
Um, and so uh, it's a really good show. I even have um, a dialect for it. Uh, so I have to practice speaking differently because, you know, we talk differently in that time period. And, and he's so, good at it. <laughs> <laughs> Don't let him go. He's good at it. He's good at it. Y'all really, it's I'm a fun show. Right. I'm all right. I'm only as good as other people on stage with me. And so, uh, Bryce Yvonne and, um, Terry, uh, Terry we, Donald, we've Terry, had her yeah, here. Terry mm -hmm. Donald. And so, uh, we knocked it out of the park. Um, and Terry is a phenomenal singer. Yes, yeah. she is. Yes, she is. Yeah, she was here. She did it. Well, we played a um, Chitta Wooda Kutta song. And she remixed it for us. You know, Chitta Wooda Kutta. She's been singing three songs in a show. Even just for that. I mean, we do all the happy things, but if you come just for that thing, that's it. When we talk about on the note of Black History Month, you know, even though February is Black History Month, I consider Black History being every month. It's not just the month of February. So for those of you who didn't know that we actually had an um, uh, uh, actual Black mental health professional way back in the centuries when people didn't even know about it. Uh, Francis Sumner, PhD, uh, is preferred to be the father of Black psychology. We, that, that, that's a note. So be on the lookout for things like that that's going to be talked about. I mean, I love talking about our history as a culture. And as a nation, you know, we build a nation. Mm -hmm. So talking about that is cool. We still build a nation. Exactly. <laughs> so later on today, I'm going to give a special announcement uh, for why he came. You know, we was doing the uh, grief and um, loss and said um, process groups. So be on the lookout for more information on that. I'm, I'm excited. Got some upcoming information on that. Uh, Elroy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, um, let me tell you, he forgot his name, but we have Ike in the place, and he is with Gospel Comedy Entertainment. Sorry, he ran away. I thought he was in here, but uh, Elroy. Uh, Elroy, do you got an announcement for Ike? Did he leave you some information for us? <laughs> oh, Quito Espanol? Well, on the... Yes. Okay, <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll. <laughs> I, can't, I, can't. I can't blame him today. Oh, 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 Spanish and you speak in English. Right. That part. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, uh, y'all come to the time we uh, work on a bunch of stuff, right? A bunch of stuff. Uh, right now, we got the uh, open mic show coming up, and it's free, free to attend. Mm -hmm. uh, I was supposed to do it free in the first place, and I didn't want to, but I got spanked by the law. Oh, don't know. They had already Thank told me, but you know, you get greedy sometimes. You know? But anyway, the show is free. Uh, and we're going to try to do that uh, at least, uh, what is it, quarterly, monthly, quarterly. every other month, something like that. Something like that. <laughs> For the new and upcoming comedians that want to do uh, clean comedy. Okay. And also uh, working on a whole bunch of. Uh, a regular company show uh, on Final Live in Kansas, Baton Rouge, uh, the uh, uh, Bayou Classic. We're traveling, y'all. Uh, Fort Worth, Austin, San Antonio, uh, it's a bunch of them. And then we're, gonna, we're working on our, uh, since September. Uh, the epic theater outside. We have a comedy show outside. Okay. She'll be the first of its kind. We outside. Uh oh. That one is the one. Okay. That's the one I really want. Oh, all right. I didn't want that. Just make sure. Right. Hey, hey, it's clean. Yeah. 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 It's clean comedy. So please be clean in your attire. Outside. Outside. Oh, okay. We'll be well. Oh, no. All right. Okay. Be what you right. Hey. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, okay, I forgot about that. Yeah, that part. It's, it's a big back season. It's a big back season. Yeah, put a hump in your mouth. I got Yes. With a fanny With a fanny pack. Hey, 
This could be a huge, big old family of family. You know, I don't know if y'all, I know you know, 1,500 seats, then they got the hill, you can sit up on the hill. You see that? Chairs and your family and pastor and your church and it doesn't matter. It could be a whole bunch of church buses. Where it's required because it's county. County, you can send a letter to the mayor and all of you. Yeah. Oh, it's the oh. <laughs> Application is application is sixty five, and it just about three hundred and some dollars because you gotta pay for all these permits. Yeah, you're free for that. Then part is five thousand. Yeah. So most places like you, you give us the five. Yeah. No, we need all that. Yeah, we need that up front. I say, you need to prove it first. Yes. Lock it in. You come on to prove it, but you gotta wait on the mayor to prove it. Yeah, that's the thing. That's. But which mayor? You know, we did, you know, we knew when uh, your sister was in office, Kathy Whitman. What? I don't know what you done done. Not you. You done done something over there. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, now now with the city of Houston, you do have to get approval. You have to do all these permits. You got to let them know how many people you got. You got to have police officers to cover those people. It's so much that it, you didn't have to do that. And then it went from city of Houston. Now you have to do that with Harris County yeah, as well. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Yeah. 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 We outside. Yeah. Yes. And we outside. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We outside. I didn't want to get fun. Oh, I'm oh, ready. Yeah. I'm ready. 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 i am ready 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 i Girl, open room for free. I thought she was like, yeah, that's her friend. Is that her boo? That's her girl. 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 Wasn't you there? Yeah. And she could say I can put my finger up on it, but she was a part of the evidence. <laughs> She's a part of the evidence. She said, so, had no problem with us getting an understanding. We we get a clear Y'all been here understanding. The Bible says, and all about getting. Getting get an understanding. Mm -hmm. So I want to understand the relationship. And and I also want to be a brother that kills on my Oh, So you have heard it here first. Gospel Comedy Entertainment is doing their first outside venue clean comedy oh. event in September 2024. You don't want to miss it. You need to put it on your calendar, put it on your uh, calendar alert, put on there that you're busy, that you're not available, that, that ten, don't put on there tentative. You know, put on there that you're busy, put it on all your calendar inserts on Outlook, on Apple, all of those. Uh, for those Droid users, those Android users, your Microsoft Outlook. For your Apple Airheads, mm -hmm. Apple Heads, put it on your Apple calendar. September 2024, you don't want to miss it. And if you have not booked your uh, 
book your room for the cruise is 150 now so Ooh. that's that's three hundred dollars. I told y'all. See y'all didn't want to listen. I told y'all. Did, did, did it change? Is it still? Yeah, it's one fifty now. It's one fifty. See, I told y'all. It, it, it went from fifty. It went to seventy five. Then one fifty. Yeah, one fifty. Yeah, you might as well come on. Oh, y'all big bank. No, that's a tax money. The whole thing off. Pay it off. Pay it off. Yeah, I don't pay the whole thing. These big ballers with these tax. You did, but I didn't have an either moment this weekend, so I didn't make no change to pay it off. <laughs> oh, oh, no change to pay it off. Oh, <laughs> so you have heard it here. We're going to go ahead and get into another uh, couple of songs, and then we're going to come back to the shoulda, woulda, coulda segment. I'm telling y'all right now, y'all, mm. we got two good ones. Ooh, y'all come on. Y'all come on. Good ones. Not yeah, y'all know how we should have could have worked. Yeah, we got, y'all we got be two good ones. So be prepared because right now, God is doing a great work in us before we do it. We're going to need to do great work first. And I'll tell you what should have been one of the Hey, people. Okay. Hey, y'all. Get ready for the shoulda, woulda, coulda. If you missed out any information about what's going on in the community, our girl Erica did bless you with the information about, of course, the comedy cruise, the Save the Silly Comedy Cruise that's happening in October 31st to November the 4th. Be prepared, get your pay your uh deposit. It's 150 per person. It used to be $50. They did an advertisement, then it's 75, now it's 150. Then we also have other things that are going on in the community. If you have not seen, is it called Young Men Cry? Black black boys, I'm talking about black boys, black boys cry. Let me tell you, I love to see a man show his emotions. And um, when he shows his emotion, that lets me know that he's connected with everything. So I appreciate it when it happens. I mean, I'm not talking about crying on a whim, but, you know, just showing your emotions is a good thing because it lets me know that you're in tune with what God has inside of you. And that is you are a man first. And black boy got all the emotions in it. Trust me, black boy's going to have you rolling on the floor. Exactly. Black boy's going to have you screaming in and laughing, everything. It got all... All emotions that just show how black men cope with different things. Yeah. But also his friends, his boys, there it's it's gonna be good. And it's doing the black history month. Right? Deluxe oh yeah, yeah. support your people. Month, deluxe theater. Support the people, support the tonight. upcoming and artists tomorrow. that are out there. So it's tonight. Uh, uh -huh. 7 30 tonight, the Lux Theater. Okay. Um uh 3305 Lounge and tomorrow it has a three o'clock show as well. All I gotta do is go to um 1989dreams.com, go to the tickets and <laughs> go to the tickets. I'm trying to help talk to the camera. Get to the camera. Go to the tickets. Get your tickets. 1989dreams.com. You can hit back um backslash black boys cry. But check out that website because he has a lot. Mr. Harold did try to put some great um, shows on and productions. You definitely want to keep up with 1989 Dream. They do doing a thing over there. Okay. And then we also have other things that's going on in the community. Uh, we have, uh, let's see, um, we have the. Of course, we talked about the Save This Silly comedy cruise. Oh, definitely. We yeah. got Fame and Silly. Y'all know that. Y'all know yeah. we got our open mic night coming. Oh. We definitely want y'all to be exactly. a part of that. And we've already got the good news. Not only is registration free, but the event is going to be free. So just come out and have a good time. Um, don't forget, y'all know your girl here, also actress. So um, I'm always trying to keep the news up on our um, events. We got Mother's Breath. This is another good... Um, Production is free also, okay? Black History Month cutting up, okay? It's by, uh, let me see, African, wait, African American History is putting this um, production on. It's going to be 803 East 36th Street, Houston, Texas, um, February 25th at 4 p.m., okay? Check it out. It's free. And, you know, don't forget your girl, the one that only Erica B is coming back to the stage. Thank God. And read Between the Lines. Coming at you April 21st at the Stafford Center, AWJ Production. See your one and only Erica B on stage. I'll have your tickets, too.
So we're going to also get into a couple of commercials to show you, show you about what's going on um, out in the community and make sure you book your tickets. Sunday, April 14th, Houston would never be the same. It's the Gigantic Gospel Concert 2024, and it's one gigantic lineup featuring Pastor John P. Key. Never shall forget. Kalanze Gibbon. This ain't no ordinary word. Also, Doc McKenzie had the highlight. The Ken Spiritual. Lisa Noel Smith and the Brown Singers. The Cardi Cortez. Luther Barnes at the Sunset Jubilee, the group Fire, and hosted by the country preacher, Carlos Daniel, it's Pastor John P. Key. Talante Gibbons, Zacardi Cortez, and more. Sunday, April 14th, at the Fountain of Praise in Houston. Get your tickets now at TicketWeb.com or Eventbrite.com. Okay. Welcome back to the Save. Welcome back to the Save the Morning Show. You just heard our announcement, the gospel explosion that's happening. Be sure to get your tickets. Um, also, if you have not heard about the grief, um, loss, and sad uh, process groups that is going on with why he came. Be sure to uh, log in um, to all of my social media platforms. You can see that information, the classes or the courses are every Wednesday and Thursday of the month. Uh, I got some exciting information that's going to go on at the end of the show that's going to talk more about that. Uh, I'm here to help you through your healing process. So um, the seats are very limited. As a therapist, we're only allowed to do 10 people per group. That way you will get effective information to be able to be applicable in your life. So again, uh, tune in to all my social media platforms, Morticia Sherman, why he came, um, and to the uh, race of praise. So we're going to get into our uh, shoulda, woulda, coulda. When we get back, make sure you're listening in. With an open mind. When an open, open mind. Yeah, okay. you gotta, yeah, you gotta have an open mind. Disclaimers on that. <laughs> Keep your mind open. Yeah, you gotta have an open mind on that. Just to the wood. Because let me tell you, God is doing a great work in us over here. We're faithful to perform because I'm telling you, we have to be saved this year. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, Lord, you are great. Hey, 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 welcome back to the Save This Silly Morning Show with your host, Marticia, your girl, Erica B. We're both hosting the Save This Silly Morning Show. Hey, hey. We have been given a privilege and an honor to do the same. We're working our kinks, pinks, pongs, and wounds when we get up here every Saturday from 10 to 1 Central Standard Time. You know, grace <laughs> and mercy. We wake up with grace and mercy, and God is doing a great work with us because I'm telling you right now. Each segment that we do, we put for a great effort. We do our homework. We we want to make sure that you, as the audience and the listeners, are being entertained and empowered, empowered through your heathen moments. Because <laughs> you know, like I said this morning, Jesus said for why you came. That's the right, part. Right. So right. you have gotten now to you're now. Uh, to the segment of the shoulda, woulda, coulda song. Now, I'm going to tell you right now, please have an open mind about this. We're going to have a conversation about what this this song is, and I'm going to let you know right now. Just please, I ain't going to say please, you better have an open mind to this one. Because I'm, I'm, I'm telling you right now. <laughs> Come on, Tina, boost it up. I gotta boost it up. I gotta boost it up. I gotta boost it up. They gotta be ready. The audience gotta be ready. I'm ready. Y'all ready? I'm ready. Because you're making me feel like I'm about to put my turn finger up right now. Get up out of here. Okay. Bro, here we go. Oh, what we about to listen to this? What we got today? What we got today? I'm sure the could have was. Yeah. I said, 
I'm gonna break out in the dance. I love it, right? Yeah. 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 That's the Jesus now. Holy Slain. Right. Hey, no yeah, I, 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 I'm, I'm not wilding out like I used to. No, yeah. I'm going to say it here. You can get better. I'm going to take my toes. You you are the south looking up. Yeah, you're the flavor. You're the flavor. I got to get saved for real. He know Jesus taught her how to cook. Yeah. And Jesus is at the first school that they went. He's used up the bottles. What did you call Moscato? Did you call it Wayne? Yeah, uh, so. Hey, no. So right now we're playing. You should call it Jaheen Change for you, and we're talking through this whole song. Yeah, yeah. You know, making it a suitable song for Jesus. But if you haven't heard that song, you need to pull it up. Yeah. And tell Jesus, I've changed for you. That's right. I'm not walling out like I used to. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> back. Yeah. yeah. He don't see everything. He yeah. don't see them, them, uh, them moments when he's yeah. in the moment. Yeah. That's what all the body parts. <laughs> <laughs> so i changed for you. The lyric to it is, I mean, that song all by itself. With Keisha Cole and Jaheen, what y'all think about that? Looking back, I thought I would never love like this. Broke so many hearts, I've changed for you. Ooh. That's a lyric. Yeah, man. Man. Hey. I, I changed for you. Yeah. 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 I changed for you. Yeah, yeah. When we talk about changing for God, hey, I'll change for you. Looking back on what used to be my life, what things don't happen because I changed. Yeah, I feel the one on my side. Yeah, I feel like I can't relate to the ball. Continue to. Yeah, continue to build your testimony. That's what you're doing. Yeah, like passports. So, so that was one. So that was one of the songs. This song right here, we'll top it off right now. So here we go. Listen to it. Should have, would have, could. Yeah. Y'all turn it back to us. Let us know. Let us know what you think. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. So zip song right here. Listen. That you just don't see. That old no more. Only takes the time. See, only him. No. Yeah. 
Y'all heard that song. Y'all listening to what we're talking about. That's right. Whitney Houston say, I want to run to you. That's so much Some of y'all need to be running. There we go. Some of y'all running the wrong no. way. Some of need that bionic run. <laughs> I need that bionic run. So she talks about Jesus holding her in her arms and keeping her safe from harm. Man, when you run to your safety, yeah. Oh. We're listening to Whitney Houston, and we're we're actually it's a shoulda woulda coulda song. So we're talking about will you stay or will you run away? So if you're still in your either moment, you may run away. Right? I'm telling you, some of them are running when they call us and everything. They run away. You know, I didn't run away. Yeah, exactly. That's who's that one to feel. Yeah, they're mad. Yeah, they're mad. Yeah, they're mad. They're just the best. They're just the best. So, when you say in this song, when she go home, she turns to you, there's nobody there for her. But Jesus is right there. She said, what's the sense of trying to find your dream without nobody to share it with? Jesus is right there. Share your dream with him. Actually, he gave you the dream. Come on now. Go so do your body friend. Well, you better be running mm -hmm. to him. That's all I'm saying. Yeah. That's all I'm right. You can still run to him. He wants the heathen. They stood over here in this corner doing this slow move. It's like, I'm like, what did you do? Yeah. Hey, y'all. 
Uh, I do apologize. My Facebook page was private. Like I said, I ran into a little bit of issues. But hey, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. Um, thank you for joining us on, on the live on Facebook. Uh, tell us what you think about the pollution water segment as well as if you have information to provide to us that's going on in the community, the church organization, uh, would you give it back to the community? Let us know. Hit us up on our social media pages and let us know what you got going on so we can spread the word. It's all about spreading the word. I tell people when they go to the even for an interview, this is a 30 minute elevation. You got the elevator pitch. Um, snap screen, uh, snap your uh, tag us, let us know. Send us pictures, let us know that you're watching your viewing. Share it with family members, friends. Co-workers, jail partners, pen pals, uh, share with them. Uh, your pen pals, uh, those who you drop the soap, let them know Jesus will pick you back up for them. Let them know. Let's just bring it here. Bye, guys. Yeah, she already served the gracious God. I promise you. They got comfortable. They don't want to You know, if you're going to share your noodles, write on the noodles. Log in to Raise the Praise 100 on Saturday mornings from 10 to 1 Central Standard Time. You know, if you pass a tissue, write it on the first piece of tissue paper for your buddies. So let them know that we are the Savior to the Morning Show. We out here doing it big in the community. We can see a growing increase. We look forward to hearing from y'all. Call us. Three uh three four six three five five oh one hundred. And if you have not gotten your tickets for the open mic, go ahead and sign up for it. You have to have a ticket to get in. It is free, but you must provide a ticket to get inside of the show. So go to gospel comedy entertainment, look for that form, uh, look for that information. It's gonna be at Max Theater. You're gonna love it. I'm telling you. I, I'm not going to get up there because I was told it was going to be nepotism. You know, I, I spread my jokes and everything here, but I don't do jokes. I throw shade. Um, but then I catch it and I throw a little bit lighter at, you uh -uh. at the same time. So make sure you, you tune in to that um, open mic, February 24th. If you're asking the day again, it is February 24th. We start probably at 7 o'clock. Don't come in there dancing, gyrating, jigging. But we need you to be in there in a place and support these comedians that are out here that are coming up to clean comedy. Um, also, um, the Save the City Comedy Cruise. Let me tell you, go ahead and book it. You're gonna see some great comedians. You may even see the ones that came to the uh, comedy open mic. You never know. Be out there to support. God support you while you can. Let me tell you, be a part of the, the up and coming. Hey, Roz. Good morning and welcome. Thank you for signing in, listening to us. Um, we're listening to some great music, having some fun up here. Tell us what's going on in the community. Let us know. Let me tell y'all something. I do multitasking. It's multitasking stuff like here. I think I'm gonna need a therapist after this. I'm a therapist doing um go ahead and, and look on our social media platforms you guys and see what's going on you go to why you can't you go to Marticia and and find out that information um and just know that we're here every saturday from 10 to 1 to the center. man let me tell you Gotta love them like you do. Open my clean comedy. Oh, for those who didn't hear, let me get close up. Clean comedy. Clean. clean. Real clean. Not, not, yeah, not the one that you tell the cousin yeah. them in the backyard, peanut. And and uh, and 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 Ray Ray Young yeah, in the back there. Uh, we do clean comedy. That's what we're doing there. Clean comedy open mic February twenty four. You can get it at matchhouston.org uh, forward slash events twenty twenty four open mic. Click on the link that you see here on live. Click on the link. When you click on that link, then you can get your free ticket. So click on that link, get your free ticket. Come out, meet your girl. I know some of y'all on here. Come, come hang out with me. Come see what's going on.
what's going on with the coming in. Make sure it's clean. Don't bring no boots, no doorway shoes. Don't bring no Valentine underwear because we're not throwing it on the stage. We're not having none of that either. So, Click on the link and get your free ticket to come watch. Um, open my cleaning comedy and support your family members. Those is too late for them to sign up. If you're a comedian, go ahead and still sign up. You still got time. You got until probably Tuesday, maybe, to sign up. Go to Gospel Comedy Entertainment. Um, there's a link on there on Gospel, Gospel Comedy Entertainment on Facebook. Click on that link, sign it up, and be uh, a, you know, be a part of the show. But please be clean. It's called clean comedy. That's what it's called. Mm -hmm. And you, uh, hey, I will be saying man, see him, and and boot you out. This time. Oh, oh, if you say a curse word, I just found out you're gonna have to pay. So that's going to cut into your Starbucks and your McDonald's and your oh, burger hello. and your chicken, your, your chicken plus. And I may have an extra jar just because my ears got pierced behind your curse words and I may have me a pickle bucket. <laughs> click on the link. You see us on there? Click on the link. Sign up if you're an upcoming comedian and you know you got the funnies, you know. You can make us laugh and tell you something's you gotta make us laugh for real. You know, you make us laugh, we may invite you to the, to the station to come and be a part of what's going on here. Yeah. You know, just got some information. I want to get a paid gig. I think I'm gonna throw my throw my head in there. I don't want to get paid. Besides being a third somebody. And that's why we love God like we do. I need your head. If you haven't heard that, hey. you better love them like you do. Hey. Good morning, good morning, good morning again. Welcome back to the Save the Silly Morning Show with your host, Matisha, your host, Erica Brady. We have our special guest inside of here. We got family. Oh, I know we invited pets. We got a dog in you? Oh, okay. Oh, uh, I don't like that. <laughs> no, that's a topic. Oh, that's a, Rick Ross. Oh, that's a, that is a topic. Taking their animals everywhere they go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, talking about the emotional support dog. I don't find no paperwork or no documents if they have no emotional support. Yeah. And, and uh, yeah. In the rock wall. Yeah. 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 That dog is more emotional support than you. Yeah, that's yeah. not. I need emotional support from your emotional support dog. Stop taking yeah. any of your way. Exactly. That's how you need emotional support. I'm sick of it. Yeah. <laughs> like, oh, the topic. The topic of the thing on the matter today. Will you or won't you? Will you or won't you? That's the couch. We all the couch. You know, yeah. <laughs> 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 Do you want you? Right away. Just bring bring to the couch. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. end it. End it. Will you wait? Oh, won't you? Think of it. Y'all think about that. Think about that. Y'all want to show us y'all on the couch. And we want y'all to respond. Hey, oh, what will you do? Oh, uh, what won't you do? That's a question right now. What questions what will you do or uh, what won't you do as a Christian? Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. What, what, what will you do as a Christian? Or what won't you do? Julie will wake up. 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 As a Christian. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good question. The, the Bible says it was good that I was a Christian. Oh, oh. to keep you there. Oh. That was the Bible. Oh. Oh. He knew. Oh. You, if he didn't put the door on your face, he could have given you that door on your face. You, you'll forget about it. Oh. Why, oh. why you leave me? Well, I'm just saying, if you got that beam in your eye, why you try to pull somebody else's eye? And you still got yours. 
It is. Are you a heathen? Exactly. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Just gonna kill him or not? Kill him. I'm gonna kill him. Okay, I'm gonna talk to you. What's the fact? That's right. The club was already killed before you. Yeah, and already died. Yeah, but it, it's it's those judgmental people. Yeah, the judgmental people that make it hard for other people. Well, actually, don't even make it hard. They just don't want to be. Yeah. You know, and the way that church is growing nowadays, the way it's growing, and, and going back to what happened with uh, Bishop Peter Murphy and that swag and surf song that he played. Oh. Nobody thought about those kids, those people got saved. They all talked about the song and the, and the lyrics to the song, but we already know that some songs have radio versions. Yeah. You know, and that kid could have been listening to the radio edited version. And that's what they were thinking of. They were not thinking of the explicit version of that song. You know, you got to meet the people where they are. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah.
recording, so that way or whatnot. But yeah. Um, make sure you call us at 346-355-0100. Let us know what's going on in the community. Let us know what's happening on your side of town, north side, east side, south side, west side, all them sides. You know, Jesus sends angels to every side, the north, the south, the east, and the west. Send us your information. Let us know what's going on in the community. Send it to your girl, Erica. Send it to me, Marcia. We'll promote it. We'll talk about it here on the radio station. Now, let me tell you something. When we talk about giving back to the community, make sure you do what you say and say what you do. Because if we come out there, we're coming out there to represent who our father and let him know the community that God does exist and that he is for real and that he loves us all. So, with that, Make sure you go into the feed. If you did not see that information about, you know, the Match Houston event, uh, make sure you go and click on the link. The link is right there before you. Get your free tickets to the event on February 24th. That's open mic. And it is clean comedy. Make sure you tune in. And it is the winner will get paid. I think I may put on some church shoes and stuff. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Does that that include me? You know, um, I think we'll do a Jermaine Dupri to put on some body socks. You never know. You know, <laughs> I make my own and my own. I think it is a baby for the Super Bowl. Those sacks are three grand. Them sacks are six grand. Six dollars. Yeah. If I can send them back, can you think? Yeah, how much they cost? They was a. I'm there. And for those of you who thought you was Usher and a roller skate, you thought you went in, went in your room and put on the roller skates and thought you was Usher and Ludacris and Lil John. Talking about, yeah, and your Lil <laughs> if you got some jokes to tell, go ahead and sign up. Click on this link right here. Sign in. Put the document on there. Again, if you come to Curse, whatever the fee is, you can double it because I'm going to have a pickle jar on the side. And you can put that money inside. So that means you need to bring. $50 for every curse word that you say. Bring $50 because I know you're going to say it more than once. <laughs> exactly. We're not going to ask you to do a three piece. I'm going to tell you, don't curse on this screen comedy show. So, yeah, because Eric and I need some chicken after the show. Yeah. <laughs> Janice, I get up there. We'll do a parte show. You do part, and I do the take. I reserve the right to refuse all of these. Uh -uh. Yeah, y'all just come on through for this comedy show. Uh, you know what? Uh, okay, so he say he want to say it. You're judging. You wanted to judge this Okay, okay. He's gonna say he want to sing that night, y'all. It's this not that. This not that. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah.
It's mama's breath. It's mama's breath. She's breathing on you. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so come here. Come to the
but they are a brotherhood that support each other. And that's what kind of like, kind of reminds me of them talking to each other through. They being real, they being transparent, they got issues, but you know, they there for their boys. And it's like, I'm gonna pull you through with your stupidity and all. Yeah, and that's what this is like, yeah, with your stupidity and all. Like, boy, you know you wrong, but we gonna stay here and help your ignorant self. <laughs> that's what I like about this story. Yeah, like, and then they, but it's one of those and that's the thing is uh generally when we do like peace slate or peace uh historical peace plays uh they're generally about slavery and all that and so i'm like well there's other periods in time and there's other stuff that you can show it's not always about slavery and so there's other like historical moments that you can show and so this one kind of it, it touches on it, but it also gives a little bit of a different side of history too. So, so they, they are, so they, are the family. Family. they are family. Yeah, they are family friendly shows. Yeah. Uh, so. Well, <laughs> which you know, <laughs> even, what? even for the black what? board, black uh, board, uh, not the little ones, not the little ones. Not, not the no, not the little little, no. but but the young boys. Yeah. Yeah. that's a good thing yeah. for them to understand yeah. that yeah. what you were taught, and and that goes back to even when we were having a conversation about you know having a relationship and the relationship with God and having heathen moments and those who refuse to acknowledge that they have heathen moments. Uh, when you are open and you can admit to those things, like with uh, black boys crying, taking a young man to see that. You were taught wrong, you know, and you have to really reconnect and redissect that thing to be able to have a better mm -hmm. understanding. And that's the issue now. A lot of people are taught the wrong thing, mm -hmm. but you're taught from another man's perspective. And mm -hmm. instead of having that relationship and going in there and reading the words for yourself, like Second Timothy 2.15, say to study. You know, and that's what you're doing as an actor. You're studying your role. Why not study your role as a Christian? You right. know, and you know, one, one of the cool things, the coolest thing about this tour uh, is when we went to Detroit. Uh, Detroit uh, was a, a great audience. And so, um, and not, not saying that Houston isn't, I haven't performed for Houston yet. So I'm excited, oh. I'm excited for this. I'm a performer of Black. Um, yeah. And then this is like my second performance for Houston. So I, I, I love to perform for the city. That's where I'm from. Uh, but when we were in Detroit, uh, after the show, because we did like autographs and stuff like we did autographs and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. And there was this kid, there was this kid, he was about 17, 18 years old. Uh, so I think it was I think it was 17 turning 18, because he was getting ready to go off to college. And he was a he was a black man, a uh, young black man, and I was like, Hey, what's going on? And he said, Man, I was just I'm, I'm really wanted to do I really want to do this. And so we kind of inspired him to like really try to pursue it. And then he got all of our autographs and stuff like that. Okay. And I got it in the race. And so like that's why we do it. That's that's why I personally do it. Um every, everybody has their gifts. And so I have kind of like we talk about running and all that, I've kind of run away from my gift. Like acting is my gift. And so that's what my tool is that I use to glorify God. And so, like, I'm, I'm a really bad, like, witnesser. Mm -hmm. Like, I, I just, I, for some reason, I just can be like, hey, you heard about Jesus? <laughs> you know, and, and, and to that, when you, when you say that, it goes back to, uh, and, and I, I laugh when people say I run. So how many times you change your shoes if you stayed running from God? Because I know them shoes that you've been mm -hmm. running with have worn down. I like what Big Skinny said, we stand still. And and we we were standing in that moment thinking that things are going to change and things are going to transpire, but it won't until we change our heart posture. Mm -hmm. It all starts with the heart posture too. So when we talk about that, and then you made a uh, you <laughs> you wrote out so you talked about something else when you said um, even with the running and 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 not being ready for ministry and stuff like that. There's a lot of people that that do that, but again, you're not running. You just not have accepted where you needed to be. You're gonna get there when you once you say, "Hey, I give up. I'm, I'm tired." Because again, I want to see your track shoes if you said you're running. We've been hearing that word. I've been running for Jesus all my life. Well, did did you not know he was sitting right there the whole time while you think you're running, doing your behind and going, "You went nowhere." So why you think you went somewhere? So. With that, so yeah, that that's a good thing, and and that's a good way to change our mindset. Mm -hmm. Is when we say those things that are cliches that we're so used to hearing people say these cliches uh, over and over again, and it's like, no, I don't agree with that. You know, we got to watch what we put out there in the air too. So yeah, give us time. I talk to people about people. 
Well, what people don't know will hurt them. Mm -hmm. So you're giving them information so then they will know so they make it much better. Mm -hmm. So we also have somebody that's been sitting over there in the time I call them. Yeah. I didn't say it's your name or your shirt twice. I didn't say a big skinny and big sexy. Yeah. So we we got two oh. Got big skinny over here, you know. Yeah. <laughs> so what you got going on, big skinny everywhere? Yeah, man, it's community and big skinny, man. I got a... Uh, we have a... Uh, Comedy show uh, on the 25th, February 25th. It's at the Upstage Comedy Club in uh, San Antonio. And you can, like, if anybody in the San Antonio area would come out and take it funny, it's a clean comedy show. Yeah, they better show up, you San Antonio family. Uh, UpstageComedy.com and get tickets to the show. If you want to be a part of that. Yo, Alvin, Peter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Well, Peter, thank you. Yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. When, uh, when, and when is that again? February the 25th. You got any other things going on? No, we got no other stuff. How can the people reach out to you? Big Skinny Show on any social media site, or you can go to bigskinnyshow.com. You can Google it. Yeah, so yeah, man, check it out. When I tell y'all on all social media platforms, this uh, Big Skinny thing that's going on, when I tell you, you need to follow him on all social media platforms because I'm telling you, that's my early morning laughter. Right. Because I never know <laughs> what demons I was fighting in my sleep that night. <laughs> and when I watch him that morning, I'll be like, oh, okay, I needed this yeah. laughter. Yeah. So, yeah. 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 Let yeah. Me go back yeah. and look yeah. at the one where he did the song by Money Long. Oh. Uh, nobody knew the chicken wing. I mean, that chicken, it was a chicken. You know what I felt? You promoted KFC so good. That should have been a good thing. Hey, I'm just going to piece of me that saved the city cruise video. We need that saved the city video cruise. Not the KFC. Not the KFC. We got the one that we have to get. Into some information. Uh, we got Erica B to talk about the show up and show out segment. Come on, Erica B, let us know what's going on. Y'all know how we do it show up and show out for our community. Let us know what you got going on. Hit your girl up on this. Okay, to say yes, if you have something you want me to talk about, or you got something going on in your community that we can show up at, let us know. Or you can always call up here and let us know, but definitely show up and show out to your community. Y'all know we got open mic night. Open mic night coming. And look, we just got some good news. Not only is registration free, the event will be free. Mm -hmm. I, um, February the 24th at the Match Theater, 3400 Main Street. Now, clean comedy. Clean comedy. So if you think you got what it takes, you know, first timers, uh, um, amateurs, pros, come on out and bless the people with some clean comedy. Let's have some fun on February the 24th at the Match Theater. Go to Gospel Comedy. Hit that link, register, go gospel comedy, let us know. Come on out now. You gotta get a ticket. Yes. Even though it's a free event, you still gotta register to get a ticket. And we want you to register. Get on up there. Come on with your clean comedy. <laughs> have us some fun. But look, don't don't think we ain't got no swear jar. Now you get up there and you lose your mind, you're gonna have to pay. You lose you're gonna your have money. to pay. Money, money. I'm going out on you. Oh. I'm going to give you some dinner on you. I wish you would. I'm be right there watching. I hope the mic night. February the 24th, Match Theater. Y'all be 
make sure you be there. Hey, and we got um a special retreat coming out. Our girl Marticia herself is gonna be in the Big Easy. It's called the Big Easy Retreat.com. Go on there. Look, it's gonna be a great event. It's during the same time as the essence. So guess what? You'll be able to retreat with the essence oh and retreat God, with Martition. Hey, yeah. with your girl. That's gonna be going down July the 6th. Have fun. B retreat is called the power of transformation. It'll be from 11 to 5 p.m. That gives you enough time to get transformed and go hit the streets at the Essence Festival. Okay. Bourbon Street. Don't, <laughs> don't drink the bourbon. But get don't drink the bourbon. Y'all heard, heard. <laughs> <laughs> And don't. don't forget, we also are having our Save and Silly Gospel Comedy, our first annual. This we we gonna turn up. We gonna turn up, y'all. You know, we gonna have some great comedians on that sh on this ship with us. Maybe we gonna have some great events going up October the 31st through November the 4th. Now look, deposit, I tried to get you when it was 50. I tried to get you when it was 75. Now it's 150. But y'all know yeah, uh, it's my big skin that told me, hey, y'all out here big banking. Y'all go ahead on. Y'all got them income tax rolling in. Y'all know what time it is. I want you to call 832-491-5382. Again, that's 832-491-5382. Start making those deposits. Go on, make them plans. Go on, get on this ship with us. Let me We're going to call some mail. Let me tell that commercial for Check this commercial live. What's up, what's up? It's your boy, Cousin Al. Listen, man, the Saved and Silly Cruise is going down October 31st. We are leaving out of Galveston, that big G. And we're going to Cazumel. Hey, como esta? Hey, me estoy muriendo como un perro abandonado. We're going out there, man. I don't even know what I just said, but all I know is I'm learning my Spanish little by little. Uh, buenos dias, uh, buenas tardes, and um, uh, que paso, uh, bien, no, bien, bien. We finna be in Cozumel. That's what I want y'all to know. So go ahead, book your cabin with LD Entertainment so you can get into all the exclusive events. I just added an event, y'all. I just added an event. I just added an event, and they might they might get mad at me. They might, like, you know, I might get fined for this, but, hey, you know, I'm going to just take the charge. But I'm challenging every comedian on the boat, every comedian to a versus. I'm challenging y'all to a versus. Like, what's up? Like, And I ain't talking about no jokes. I'm talking about a wet T-shirt contest. Because, I mean, you think you could beat me at a wet T-shirt contest? Bear to the law, to the law, no, no, no. So yeah, I, I'm, I might as well just keep on eating so I can win. Cause I mean, I just don't see. I ain't no using me stop eating now. Cause on the boat, I'm finna be eating burgers and and fries and and chicken and squirrel and all kind of stuff they go have on there. But anyway, go ahead and book your cabin while it's cheap. LD Entertainment. The number is somewhere around here. And uh, why do I keep pointing like it's actually right here? It should be right here in front down down here. I don't know. I don't know. Book it. Be sure to book. That is just one comedian. If y'all love Al, just imagine what's going on on this ship. October 31st through November the 4th. Going to Cozumel. 150 is your deposit. We want to see y'all there. We're going to have a good time. Also, just a couple of more things that's going on. We got TKK offering a dispatching course for only $200. They are offering after pay. That's going to be held March the 16th from 10 to 4. They're providing lunch. Learn how to book your loads. Learn how to find drivers. Learn how to upscale. Learn how to um, call out the middleman. This will be a great um, second job. Save for yourself or, you know, do it for your family. Get in there. The industry is always um, open and right and all types of drivers. So, yeah. TKK. Give them a dispatcher class. Get involved. For two hundred dollars, it's after pay. Make a little deposit. They got you. Um, March the sixteenth, eight three two six six five zero three eight six. Again, that's eight three two six six five zero three eight six. And if you're in the mood for some poetry tonight, Soul Poetry is having an event tonight. Um, it's called For the Love of Poetry. It'll be at Shot Town Wings at fifty sixty FM nineteen sixty tonight. Go on out here, love poetry. Get those snaps up. Get those snaps up. And just to don't forget, tonight we were talking about Black Boys Cry. We'll be at the Deluxe Theater at 3305 Lowndes Avenue. Showtime 730 tonight and also tomorrow at 3. Go to www.1989dreams.com. Also, Mother's Breath, February the 25th. 4 p.m. That is an African American history program. It'll be at 80336 um, East 36th Street, Houston, Texas. That event is free. And don't forget, yours truly will be coming at you April 21st. 
read between the lines. You don't want to miss it. Great stage play. The singing is going to be awesome, but the message is going to be better on this one. Trust and believe me. Your girl, Erica B., Stafford Civic, Center, Stafford Civic Center. You can get your tickets at AWJ Production or through me. And that's what we got going on in the streets. If you have anything, please reach out to me. Let me know what you got. Contact me at It's Okay to Say Yes Instagram or Facebook. Let me know what you got. I'll call here at the station. 346-355-0100. That's it. And if you want to listen to some good gospel music, here we got information on that as well. Come on out to this event. Listen to the Sunday, April 14th. Houston would never be the same. It's the Gigantic Gospel Concert 2024, and it's one gigantic lineup featuring Pastor John P. Key, Never shall forget. Kalanze Given. This ain't no ordinary word. Also, Doc McKenzie had the highlight. The Ken Spiritual. Lisa Noel Smith had the Brown Singer. The Cardi Cortez. Luther Barnes at the Sunset Jubilee, the group Fire, and hosted by the country preacher, Carlos Daniel, it's Pastor John P. Key. Talante Givens, Zacardi Cortez, and more. Sunday, April 14th, at the Fountain of Praise in Houston. Get your tickets now at TicketWeb.com or Eventbrite.com. Hey, we back. Hey there, hey there, hey there. We are back live with you, with the audience. I mean, let me tell you, we got some announcements going on here. So we got another announcement coming up about the gospel comedy crew. You're going to want to hear this. What's going on with the comedy crews? We'll be talking. Oh, oh, uh, I also got about this. Uh, and and, and uh, I got a message that. So for the comedians that are going to perform on the cruise, and I remember that uh, uh, Paula was looking for clean comedians. So uh, I'm telling all comedians to sign up, that if you sign up and you get on the cruise and we put you on stage, if Carnival chooses you, you have to have an, uh, an agent. Okay, that's what they require. So they, if, you, if they choose you and you say you don't have an agent, then they're going to tell you to get on about your business. Oh. So is GCE an agent? Well, that's what I was saying. Oh, so okay. I'm just asking. If you don't have an agent, just tell them GCE is your agent. Okay. Okay. So just a reminder of that. Oh, yeah. I was reminded of that the other day when I was looking through the paperwork that uh, in the comedians that are uh, chosen, to work with Carnival, have to have an agent. Okay, and that's you, good. And if you don't have one, Got to Come Entertainment will be your agent. Now, if you want Got to Come to be Entertainment to be your agent, there's some paperwork involved because you got to have that too. Yeah. So just FYI, uh, I'll probably put a message out on, on social media uh, for the comedians to see just so they understand because we got some of the best comedians. I don't want nobody to miss out because they don't have no agent. Yeah. So just putting that out there, put it out on the app, uh, so they'll know. So and it will pass the word along to the comedians as well. Uh, but you know, again, and I and I am pretty sure most of them don't have an agent. Okay. So if you don't, you get on this cruise, or you get on this cruise, just say, hey, I want uh got to come to and be my agent. That way, if uh and let me let me let me bag up a little bit because most of the time when you have an agent and you have to perform, they take a percentage, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. We're not gonna do that. Let's be the okay. living We're just gonna be your legal agent uh, for you. Okay. Okay. We ain't, you know we ain't trying to make twenty percent of your money. We not? No. Uh, can I borrow some? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> can I get a tip? <laughs> I'm Christ-like. I want a tent. I want a tie. <laughs> it, it, it ain't gonna be free. Right. But what we gonna do is, uh, uh, like, uh, some some places do. Uh, we don't we don't charge you a percentage of the money that you make. We just charge like a monthly fee, maybe like hundred fifty dollars or something. 
That's not bad. So you can make all the money you want. All you do is pay $150. You beat that with a bad. So that's that's how we want to do it. Uh, or that's one way to do it. Or if you do say, hey, no, I won't pay y'all 5% of everything I make. Okay, cool. That's what we'll do. I mean, you hit a blessing, so why not be a blessing? But some I'm people, just, we got to change the mindset. I'm just saying that because I know the business. I know how it is. You know, so. Oh, Lord. Miss Janice coming as a comedian. Uh-oh. Oh, <laughs> Praise God. <laughs> Mighty God. She won't need an agent. <laughs> she won't need an agent. <laughs> Miss Janice, I say you don't need no agent. <laughs> Go to the dance, <laughs> I think he's saying you're not gonna win, Miss Janet. No, no. Audition for consequences, but great. <laughs> yeah. yeah, do that, Miss Janet. Come out to open mic. Yeah. We see what you, you got. Yeah, all right. that's all I want. Thank you. That's great information. You heard it here first uh, from GCE that um, if you're going to be on the comedy cruise and you are a comedian, you are a comedian or perspective comedian we hope that if you're a perspective comedian that you come out to open mic uh on the 24th of february and give us what you got and we ain't giving no po chops but give us what you got uh at the, at the comedy show at the clean comment remember it's clean it's gonna be 50 dollars per curse word because we don't have two buckets they're gonna charge you 25 and we gotta charge you 25 for the piercing of our ears that you decided that you want to throw a little word in there that was not a part <laughs> So, with that, I'm as well team. as you heard some other announcements that are going on, uh, Gospel Comedy Entertainment is doing their first outdoor event this coming September 2024. We're going to be outside, y'all. We're not just going on a cruise and turning a ship around. We're going to be outside with the people, bring your umbrellas. Don't bring your coolers because we don't know what you're going to have inside of it. No, 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 no. We'll see. We'll see what the guidelines and situations you know, mm -hmm. so with that, it's going to be in September of 2024. You heard what Big Skinny got going on. And uh, next Sunday, the 25th, after the clean open mic, let me tell you, I don't know what's going to be said in San Antonio. So if you want to curse there, you may be able to curse there. But you can't curse at the moment. <laughs> baby Jesus <laughs> might show up. It's a clean show. Yeah, baby, baby Jesus oh. might show up. Oh, no, it's season. And then the fact. <laughs> oh, mighty God. <laughs> and then the football player may show up with the tiny <laughs> shirt. Mighty God. <laughs> and be prepared. You know, don't ever come to a house empty handed. You know, come to a house open hearted with an open hand. Go ahead and support your local comedians here in the Houston area, your local artists, everybody out here. It's enough. Uh, food out there for us all to eat. Just be supportive of those that you hear that are on the radio station. Um, Gospel Comedy Entertainment, you can find all the information on there. You can find it on the, you know, the Fire Show. She has the postings on there. You can find it on It's Okay to Say Yes. You can find it on uh, Big Skinny. You can find it on Morticia um, and Why He Came. All this information is great news that you can use outside in the community. Now, Special announcement before we get into this music where I'm going to change your life. Uh, <laughs> um, Why He Can is doing uh, Grief, Loss, and Sad, which is Seasonal Def Affective Disorder Process Groups. We've been doing it every Wednesday, Thursday for the month of February, which we call Freedom February. Now, we have just added on April, March and April. Wednesdays in March and April, and we're also doing virtual on Tuesdays. So if you're not able to come on a Tuesday, I mean, come on a Wednesday or a Thursday for grief counseling, join us on um, Zoom on Tuesdays. Hey, I want to set you free. I want to set your soul on fire for God and not have you in the dark with no mm -hmm. wisdom because God say his people perish for lack of knowledge. And mm -hmm. I want to give you that knowledge on grief, what grief really is, what loss really is, and what uh, sad is. Grief is not always the loss of a person. Grief is also That's the loss true. of a job, a relationship, the loss of a car, losing your money. You probably dropped right. $20 somewhere and can't find it because you wanted to go and buy that chicken and now you're depressed. Ooh, and you know, hey, 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 let's give me some grief counseling. Okay. So, uh, come on, get, get, get the knowledge that you need. Paperwork information will be provided. Um, my website will be up uh, on this on this week 
but you can also find the information on all my social media platforms. Come on out. Let me be a blessing to you to start your healing process. Um, the process groups is $30. You can't find therapy for $30 for no one hour session. I'm telling you right now, there's no way possible. Not no real. We're not no real therapy. Not no real. You know, you go, unless you got Medicaid and you go into the Harris Center, but, yeah. <laughs> but you still got to pay us for what we do. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so with that, we're going to get into a bit of music and we're going to come back and we're going to bless you uh, for the rest of this day because we're about to head up out of here. I am hungry. I don't know if I want to bake potato or if I want some. What you see in the Yeah. Oh. Uh, hey, hey, my stomach started talking. That was my that was my inside voice. Oh. <laughs> that was my inside voice to hit my outside voice. So we're gonna go ahead and get into some great music um before we close out the day. We're gonna close out the day, uh, but we're not gonna close out everything with you. We'll see you again next Saturday. But here at Raise the Praise with the uh Save the Sunday Morning Show, where we praise every day, all day. I was wondering where this week was. You going? Yeah, that's what. Hey, people. Hey, people. Hey, people. We're almost at the end of the day. Go on, follow me, Miss Janice. Come on now. Uh, share the good news with everybody. Yes, why he can't is doing grief, uh, loss, okay. and sad reason of def uh, affective disorder. Also, I forgot now, you, the ones who are paying attention, March, I don't call March, March Madness. We are doing a painting class in March. It's called Painting Your Trauma on a Canvas. And we're going to talk about that thing. We're going to break that thing down. We're going to get up under that rug. We're going to sweep all that dirt from up under there. Share with your people. You're going to see it on all my social media platforms. It's called Painting Your Trauma on a Canvas. Come on, be a part of it. Come on, join in. Wednesday, Thursdays, we're going to be face-to-face. -face. Tuesdays is virtual. Look out for those Saturdays in March. As well as some other things that Why He Can't is coming up with for the 2024 year. I'm all about the people being saved and healed and being silly while we're doing it. So we're going to have fun learning the good things about where you need to be as a person when it comes to healing and being a better you. You can't be good for your, nobody else if you're not good enough for yourself. So we're going to work on that. Um, come out to put it on your calendar, September 2024. We, we don't have a day yet in September for 2024. I don't think so. But be on the lookout on Gospel Comedy Entertainment for the day on September where they're gonna we're going to have uh, a comedy show. And I think it's, what's the name of that part? It's not Adair Park. Mm, just follow the page. Just yeah. follow the page because you know your girl got a lot going on in her thoughts and all, everything. But yeah, go to Gospel Comedy Entertainment to all the social media pages. You will see that information on there about um, the, and then look on there for open mic. All the links are on there as well for open mic. If you want to be a comedian, I can't do it because it's nepotism. Y'all already heard that I'm not a good comedian already. I just throw slugs and then I throw a little light with it behind to follow. Stay. Uh, I, all day. Shady. All day. Yeah. All it's shade. Shade. Yeah. It's shade, but I let you raise it up. Yep. Yep. Get light, a little bit of light in. <laughs> <laughs> also, on there, um, open mic, like they said, if you use any type of improper language, that's how I'm going to say it, improper language. If you, if you spell... Yeah, Even if you yeah. spell the curse word, we're going to get you. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so be a, come out, be a part. It's at Machiator. You can see the link on the Gospel Comedy Entertainment as well. All information that we do here on the Save the Silly Morning Show, you will find that on Gospel Comedy Entertainment. You will find that on all our social media platforms. For everybody who will be here on Saturdays from 10 to 1, remember... 10 to 1 Central Standard Time is when we're here and we need you to be here in the place as well. So we're going to go ahead and close out. Make sure you follow us on all our social media platforms. We'll be looking for you. We may friend you or we may not friend you. Don't be giving us no fake and phony pages. Don't be giving us no fake and phony pages. We're not doing that. Don't be talking about your name Alberto and your name Rarita. That's a shame. <laughs> you yeah. Oh.
Have a good one, you guys. Yeah. <laughs>